Scott. Scott. Ayo. Congressman Quigley entered into the congressional record on May 2nd. Um, Mr. Speaker, I rise today to celebrate the 75th anniversary of Chicago's iconic hot dog stand Superdog. Established in May of 1948 by high school sweethearts Maury and Florence Flory Berman, Superdog first opened at the corner of Milwaukee and Milan in Chicago. Today, Superdog continues to be family owned and operated in the same location. Despite the small changes they have undergone over the past 75 years, the famous Superdog recipe of the driving concept can remain the same. Just as they did in 1948, customers can order from their car and have a car out delivered their order on a tray. Superdog has remained committed to providing quality products and service, making each customer's meal to order and affirming the belief that the customer is always right. They continue to insist that the customer should be treated as family, setting them apart from other fast food establishments. In 2010, I spent the day, this is Congressman Quigley talking, I spent the day working at Superdog as part of my undercover congressman series. There I learned how to make the famous Superdog and gained an inside look into what has made them so successful. As someone who has been a beloved Superdog fan throughout my life, I am honored to help them celebrate this exciting milestone. And that was entered into the congressional record on May 7th. And last but not least, 
Um, we have our state senator, Ron McGottam, and our state rep, Mike Kelly, state senator, Ron and state rep, Mike Kelly, for that be here today. They're in Springfield, they're legislating, but they will be introducing proclamations, resolutions for the state senate, the state legislature, so that um, we are going to be presented with that in different days when we're free from their legislative session. Okay, we're ready now to sing. Um, we're not.